This video is about connecting your Elgato uh, device to your Open Broadcaster software and see it as a video capture uh, device. So um, I've got the Open Broadcaster software. Um, I add a source as a video capture device. I say, OK, I can see the different capture device I have, but I don't see Elgato. So what is the problem? If you go on the Elgato website, there is explanation about uh, connecting your OBS to the, your Elgato, but there is no mention of uh, different versions of uh, Elgato software, 32 or 64 bits. And if you go on the uh, page to download the software, the Elgato software, you can see there's two versions, the 32 bits and the 64 bits. I did install the 64 bits, and if you look at the um, software installed after that, you can see that it installed the software, but a bunch of drivers for the different Delgado devices, and these drivers are probably 64 bits related. So the problem is to match your 64 bits version of Elgato with the 64 bits version of Open Broadcaster software. If you go on OBS website, all the links here, it's going to, on Windows at least, install the Windows installer, which is by default a 32 bits version. In order to have the 64 bits, in my case, I click on download. And if you use the original version of OBS, you've got the ability to download as a zip. And then you can see inside the zip a 32 or 64 bits folder. If you use the multi-platform like me, um, there's no uh, direct link for the zip, so you can go to the GitHub source code, go into releases, and there, at least on this version, there's a zip available for the uh, exe of uh, OBS. Um, that's what I'm currently using. I'm to the 64 bits folder, and um, this is OBS I'm using here. Now, if, I've gone, if I want to, uh, to add the Elgato, I just click uh, into the 64 bits. I just click plus. Um, video Game Capture Device. And uh, this time, I can see there's the Elgato Game Capture Device uh, available. Um, after a few, a, few, a little delay, it should be able to see the HDMI, uh, well, the, the Elgato source. So this is my Chromebook, which is connected to my Elgato. So now I really have it as a video capture device and I have all the power and flexibility of Helgero. I hope it can be useful to, to someone else.